an arrest has been made in the stabbing death of a 15-year-old boy who was brutally attacked on a New York City street last week in a case of suspected mistaken identity. Kevin J. Alvarez, 19, was taken into custody Saturday and charged with second-degree murder, manslaughter, gang assault and assault in Lissandro, Jr., Guzman Felice's death on Wednesday, authorities said. A search is ongoing for several other suspects in Guzman Felice's death, the New York Times reported Sunday that the New York Police Department mistakenly announced more arrests in the case, PIX 11, citing a law enforcement source, reported that four suspects were taken into custody in Patterson, New Jersey, on Sunday. The stabbing murder of this young man is among the most brutal crimes I've seen in my 36 years career. At Knife Detectives are working hard to capture these killers, but we also need your help. Watch this video and call. One video captured him, bleeding on the ground as witnesses scrambled to help. Police Chief Terrence Monaghan in a Twitter post on Friday described the teenager's death as among the most brutal crimes I've seen in my 36 years career. Guzman Feliz's family, speaking to the New York Post, said members of a street gang apologized to them for the attack, saying they got the wrong person. Police sources confirmed that possible mistake to the Post. I know it doesn't mean a lot. It wasn't supposed to be him, read a message allegedly sent by a top leader in the gang to the family, according to 19-year-old Derek Grellin, who is the boyfriend of Guzman Feliz's his sister. Lissandro, Jr., Guzman Feliz, 15, was fatally stabbed on a sidewalk in New York City. He aspired to be a police officer one day, his family said. Guzman Felice's mother, Leandra Felice, told the New York Times that her son was attacked after stepping outside to lend a friend $5. She said he aspired to be a police officer one day. His dream was to be a detective, she told the paper. Since he was five years old, he used to love to play with the police toy cars and always said he wanted to be a detective. A photo of Guzman Feliz shared by the NYPD shows him wearing a jacket for the Forces Explorer program, which introduces city 14 to 20-year-olds to careers in law enforcement. In the Bronx on 620th, 15-year-old Junior Guzman Feliz was fatally stabbed by the men in the photo on right. He was never going to give up on his dream of being an NYPD detective. Help us get pick.twitter.com slash ogivemfmec7f, Chief Dermot F. Shea, at Knife Detectives, June 23, 2018 News of Guzman Felice's violent death has garnered attention nationwide, fueling the hashtag. Rapper Cardi B, who grew up in the Bronx, made an $8,000 donation to a GoFundMe page for Guzman Felice's family on Sunday under her legal name, Belkley Salmanzar, in an Instagram post she called the Bronx streets ruthless, a post shared by Cardi B official IG, at I am Cardib, on June 22, 2018 at 9.50 a.m. Pacific Daylight Saving Time singer Rihanna also shared her heartbreak over his death, posting on Instagram on Sunday, can't stop thinking about this poor baby boy, and how his family must feel right now. I'm sincerely praying for your healing and I'm a father of four and couldn't imagine losing any one of my own kids, Sabathia tweeted. The violence and hate needs to stop. There's too much other stuff already going on in this world. It hurts me every time I see a story like this in the news. I'm a father of four and couldn't imagine losing any one of my own kids. The violence and hate needs to stop. There's too much other stuff already going on in this world. Authorities are asking for help from the public with identifying suspects captured on video in the assault. 
They were seen entering a white vehicle and a dark-colored sedan, police said. Anyone with information is asked to call the NYPD's Crime Stoppers hotline at 1-800-577-TIPS-8477 or, for Spanish 1-888-57-PISTA-74782. The public can also submit tips by logging on to the Crime Stoppers website at www.nypdcrimestoppers.com or by texting tips to 274,637 crimes, then entering TIP 577. The NYPD and the Patterson Police Department did not immediately respond to requests for comment on reports of additional arrests made. Download, 